What's up y'all? I want to welcome y'all back to 80 Cooks and on the menu today is a roasted pork loin in the oven and uh, I appreciate you all for tuning in and what I have in front of me is a half a piece of pork loin. I didn't want to cook the whole piece so I cut it in half. As you can see there's fat on this. I'm keeping it on there because pork loin is a lean piece of meat and I want that fat while I'm baking it in the oven for flavor. What I did off camera is I put some olive oil. First I patted everything dry, put olive oil on this, and now we're gonna start with simple seasonings on this. We're gonna go in with some black pepper. And do not be scared to season this because this is a thick piece of meat. We're going to go in with some salt. And we're going to put us a little bit of regular, just simple regular paprika on this top of it. And that's all we're doing right now. We'll flip it over and do it on the other side. Okay, once you have your pork loin seasoned, what we wanna do, if you just took it out of the fridge or it's still cool to the touch to this, you wanna let this sit out for about maybe 15 to 20 minutes. Okay, into a nice size cast iron skillet, we're gonna take us some bacon grease that we used this morning to fry our bacon in. And we just want to let this heat up real nice because when that loin hits that grease, we want to get a crust on this loin. All right, skillet should be nice and hot. So what we're going to do is we're going to put our loin in and we're going to put it the fat side down. And we just want to let this get a nice color on this. We're not trying to cook this, you all, in this cast iron skillet on top of the stove. We're just trying to get a nice color on this or a nice crust on top of this. All right, we're going to go ahead and flip this over. You want to kind of keep it on there probably for about three minutes. Let it brown on the other side, about three minutes on that as well. All right guys, once you have it browned on every side of this pork loin, you wanna turn this off, because we're gonna put this in the skillet in our cast iron. What we wanna do is take us a little bit of minced garlic and kinda of spread it over the top of this. And this is going to go into a 400 degree oven and we'll let it bake. The ideal temperature that we're looking for for this uh, pork loin to get is uh, 145 to 155. Okay guys, pork loin is done. We're gonna let it rest for a minute and uh, then we'll go ahead and cut into this. All right, once our flour has cooked down a little bit, we're gonna go in with a little bit of water on this. And with a little more, because we wanna pour those good flavors up from the bottom 
inside this uh, skillet. bit of salt to it. A little bit of black pepper. And we should be good on this. Turn this down a little bit. Alright guys, pork tenderloin set for a minute. We're gonna go ahead and try to cut into this. Should be very juicy and tender. All right guys, pork tenderloin is cut. And uh, this is the sauce that I made up earlier. Or the gravy, you can call it whatever you wanna call it. But I did drain a lot of the uh, dark pieces out of it. I think that was a lot of the garlic that burnt off on it. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna pour a little bit of this over the top of it. There we have it, y'all. Our pork loin is done. If I did say tenderloin in this video, you all, I, I apologize. That's kind of hard to get them. It's kind of easy to get it confused, but this is the loin of the pig. Uh, I really appreciate you all for tuning in. Please like, share, and subscribe, and peace.